Hey Nokia fans, it's Mark for the Nokia vlog and this is the Nokia Lumia 1020 for AT&T. In this video, I'm going to show you a quick tip on how to force your phone into just going into 4G or LTE. So what you need to do is go into your phone application and enter pound pound 3282 pound and you will go into field test. There's a quick message, just go ahead and click accept. Don't select anything from this list. Go down to where the three dots are and click settings. There should be a network type option here. If you just want your phone to connect to LTE, you could select 4G only. If you want to connect your phone into just 4G and not LTE, uh, that's HSPA plus, uh, select 3G only. So right now I'm connected to LTE here in New York because LTE is uh, available here in my area. Now if I don't want LTE, I just want to connect, connect to HSPA Plus, I'm going to select 3G only. And as you can see here, the LTE signal changes back into 4G. Now why would you want to do this? Uh, maybe because your area is not connected or is not covered by LTE and you want to save your battery, you don't want uh, your phone to continue looking if there's LTE signal uh, that might waste some battery so you that's why you would want to do this uh, this option is actually available on the Lumia 925 it's built in you don't need to go into field test just go to settings and there should be cellular right there if you go at the bottom there there's an option that says highest connection speed you have option for 2G 4G and LTE this setting is not available on the Nokia Lumia 1020 that's why you need to go into field test which is what I'm showing you right now if you want to go back to automatic just select automatic and your phone will go back to where it was before it will go into LTE if it's available or if not it will go back to 4G or HSBA plus so that's a quick tip for the Nokia Lumia 1020 um, if you found this video helpful click on that thumbs up button it helps me out and lets me know that these videos are actually helpful to you guys. That should be it. I'm Mark Wim for the Nokia blog. Thanks for watching.